Nairobi fly, Peteris dermatitis, introduction, Peteris dermatitis, also known as dermatitis linearis or blister beetle dermatitis is a peculiar irritant contact dermatitis characterized by erythematous and bullous lesions of sudden onset on exposed areas of the body. Thus, the disease is provoked by an insect named Nairobi fly which is belonging to the genus Peteris. This beetle does not bite or sting, but accidental brushing against or crushing the beetle over the skin provokes the release of its colomic fluid which contains peterin, a potent toxin that causes blistering and dermatitis. Epidemics, the dermatitis may affect persons of either sex, all ages, races or social conditions, since it depends on the patient's activities and insect habitat. Symptoms, burning and or itching sensation, which eventually leads to swelling, ugly patches of blisters on affected areas, as well as severe itching. Clinical appearance of Peteris dermatitis may be confused with herpes simplex, herpes zoster, liquid burns, acute allergic or irritant contact dermatitis, millipede dermatitis and phytophotodermatitis. Treatment, the cases should be managed as irritant contact dermatitis, removal of irritant, initial washing with soap and water, application of cold wet compresses followed by topical steroid and antibiotic, if secondarily infected. Prevention, learn to recognize Peteris beetles and avoid handling or crushing these insects against exposed areas of skin, keep doors closed and put screens on doors. Both doors and windows should be kept in good repair to reduce the entry of beetles into buildings. Sleeping under a bed net, preferably for methrin treated, may also reduce the probability of a beetle falling on the skin during the night. A net or mesh can be tied under the lights to prevent the beetle from dropping onto humans. Avoid crushing the beetle on the skin, manipulating primary lesions or rubbing the eyes following primary involvement. If a beetle lands on the skin, try to remove it gently, example, blow it off, try to get the beetle to walk onto a piece of paper and then remove it. Wash contact areas of the skin. Check areas for beetles, especially on walls and ceiling around the light before going to bed. Avoid handling the beetle directly. Clear excess vegetations from and around the residence, as beetles may rest in these areas.